Feels good. Jeez. Three two. That was out the window, wasn't it? Right. Oh, sorry. We're, we're, I didn't realise we was loud. It's me, me just having a little chat. Hey, Brett. Um, first of all, massive well done. First league game of the season. Obviously, um, you've won five two. Tell us how you're feeling at the moment because uh, first game of the season feels good. Oh yeah, yeah. Of course. Really, really happy. Really, really happy with the performance. Uh, some very good individual performances, but as a team, we, we performed really well. Um, I thought there was a couple of. I wasn't happy with the, the first goal. It was a poor goal to give away, but um, you, you take these ones in the chin because the lads got themselves back into it and, and we extended the lead. And then penalty is never a penalty. He's, he's got the ball all day long. And well, we, the, we, the we, says we, he's got the ball and caught the man after it, um, which doesn't make any sense. But as well as don't not worried about that. And so we've watched it four times. It was an air kick, and he fell off after the air kick. That's what we saw. But. Um, you must be really, really happy with that. Because, like I say, I'm trying to think of a player who didn't shine. It was a great team effort. Yeah, the, like I said at the start of the game, they're a strong side. Um, and we've put them away with relative ease. So I'm, I'm over the moon with that. Um, and we've done. We've, we've put the goals. We've, we've got the goals that we, were, we knew they were going to come. We've, uh, we've had a few games where we, we, we didn't score any goals and, and we struggled a bit. But that's, that's what I said. I'm not really, <coughs> I'm not really interested in, in pre-season games and panic at pre-season games when people are saying oh you're not scoring goals you're not this when it comes to our level and when it comes to games and when it means things then the lads turn up and that that's the main thing so and we've done that today we could could have e could have easily have been about another three so. so well today today's uh, match sponsors uh mooney's men give daniel man of the match he's had a very good game didn't he his oh, pace yeah. is electric yeah yeah he's 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 very very quick and he's He's direct, and that's what we need. That's what we've always lacked a bit uh, at Bridlington for a few seasons now, and he's direct, and that's why I tried so hard to get him in, because he's he's a, he's a thorn in the side of any defence. So um, he just needs to work on... Sometimes he needs to work on when he's in, in the box, he needs to work on uh, his finishing when it comes to to, to the, kinda, the easier ones, if you know what I mean. He tries too hard to just put it in, and sometimes it's you, you don't think with any ones, you just roll them in, and... A lot of the time it goes away for you, so but you can't take away anything from his effort. I thought uh, well, Allen played very well in the he second did. half today. Uh, I thought Pete Davison was brilliant in there, and Andy Knock when he came on was was outstanding. Obviously, a fantastic strike as well. Um, but the defence, Jenks, Jenks was solid, absolutely solid today. He won everything. He even uh, he even set a few goals up <laughs> and scored one as well. So we're, we're over the moon. To talk about P Pete in the centre mid, I thought it was very calm. He, he seems to know them angles, how to clear the pressure in that middle of the pad by just coming out wide. He did really well in there, didn't he? Just sitting in front of the uh, the back four. Listen, Bridlington are very, very lucky to have a player like Pete. Very, very lucky. The, the, the guy should be playing a lot higher. So we you just need to um, just need to be over the minute that we've actually got him and, and enjoy watching him play week in, week out because he's, he's effortless. A, he's a, he's effortless, a isn't he? Voice of a player. So we just need to um, really get everybody playing. Uh, round about him and, and knowing the, his kind of his football and his, his mind where he wants to play and listen we'll be we'll, we'll be tough to beat well I, I thought a funny one that I saw today was when Billy Lurgan and their keeper had a bit of a ding dog yeah. and then literally two minutes later out of all the players who could have scored Billy Lurgan with a lovely finish as yeah. well done well put a shift in feet uh, today no, no, way, no better way than sticking it up somebody in there when you when especially a goalkeeper when he tries to stick one on you and then you then you go and hit a shot and he flaps it and it goes in the net there you go then you just go and run up to him and say there you go that's exactly what happens cameras are sometimes a bitch <laughs> <laughs> so obviously we, we now obviously first league game out the way you've got your three points in the bank there well done yep. Nairs were Tuesday night any injuries anything that you're worried about that you've no, no we seem to be alright um, we seem to be alright we're just looking obviously actively looking for a physio as well uh, Lamp's done a great job there with his water bottle <laughs> today. Uh, no magic sponge, unfortunately, but he had the water bottle. So um, now we we need to we're looking for a physio. Um, so it's just, it's just been a bit difficult how, how it's happened that, you know, so, so late on in the preseason. But Neil's probably tough.
What I would say is, um, I'm, I'm sure when we go in that clubhouse after uh, after this interview, there's, there's going to be a lot of supporters with big smiles on their faces. Yeah, Brett, so, so massive well done today, sir. What we will do, obviously, we'll be coming up to Nairsbury with you, so we'll, we'll speak to you before the game. But like I said, enjoy today, Brett. Yeah, First game you. of the season. No Your problem. team looked very, very, very good. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Cheers, Brett. Take care.